who's been on the course and waiting for a long, long time, I think she's through. I think she has booked herself a ticket in the final, which would be great news for the German. Will she have a German teammate in there? Because Eleanor Lillick would like to have her say. She's the 2021 world champion, and she also won gold at the European Games in 2023. So, and she's going to the Olympics. She's going to the, the Olympics, Eleanor Lillick, to do the C1. Of course, she can do the K1 as well. She's very competent at both. But she got selection for the C1 in a pretty fierce contest with uh, the double world champion Andrea Herzog and Lilik coming out on top to get herself that ticket for Paris. A nice strong start at the moment for Lilik. Everything going to plan. No touches. No obvious time lost so far and the Germans once again will have a very strong team at the Olympics Ricardo Funk of course now look at that there so she slipped down to four and a half seconds outside Pankova's time but there is lots of lots of wriggle room because there's a big gap in times spaced out over the top four paddlers so don't stress if you are an Eleanor Lillick fan watching at home, uh, there are, there's plenty of wriggle room there to get yourself into the final. And it's been a good bottom half of this race. I think she's picked up some good time here. So she's going to be very close, maybe just yes, She'll be just outside the 100 mark. But is this going to be enough for Eleanor Lillick? She crosses now into fifth. And yes, gives herself, there you go, she leapfrogs her teammate Nellie Bain and has an F next to her name, which means she is in the final.